What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to Sheriff Sunday. Uh, this is gonna be episode four. Thank you guys so much for all the support on the recent episodes. Oh, let me slow down. But yeah, um, currently on the way to Gas and Go because this car is like very dirty. I don't know if you can tell or not. I've been uh, in the mud a lot, so it's not really, really good. But Gas and Go has a car wash service. Yep, there's a lot of people over there right now. And they're washing people's cars. So I guess that's good, you know. Washing people's cars. Alright, let's turn in here. This guy's car is smoking. What's going on? Alright. Let's get out. I'm gonna just tell him basically need my car wash. Hello, sir. Uh, you have a car washing open right now? Yes, sir. Okay. Great. Um, yeah, you look at my car. You just see it's like very... I need a wash. Like ASAP. You have the foam wash, which is... Uh, I heard it's one of the best services here. Uh, it's even better than that one, I heard. So that's a good sign. Indeed, yeah. But yeah, sir, if you can just uh, start washing my car now. I'm on duty, so if I do have a call, I'll have to leave, so... All of our foam washers are free for law enforcement. Well, that's pretty cool. So yeah, it's already going away. That's that's a good sign. Hello. Oh, I'm just gonna go. I need my daily chocolate milk. Just get that from there. And then uh, I don't need anything else. So let's just get the drink. Why not? Howdy, deputy. Aren't you supposed to be on shift? I mean, corporal. Aren't you supposed to be on shift, corporal? What's going on? All right, guys. It's our time. I need to pay for this chocolate milk. Hello, sir. Uh, just be, it should just be one chocolate milk right there. How much would that be? I think yeah, it has to be, it's $2.99, right? It's always $2.99. It's gotta be always $2.99. I, I always pay $2.99 for it, so. Yeah. $2 equals, uh, no, that $3 equals $2.99, but, uh, same difference. Alright, here you go. Give that to you. You can go ahead and scan my card gonna eat this apple what is that guy talking about bro's buying an apple from a gas station crazy all right thank you all right looks like he's done foam washing my car which is pretty nice hello you done foam washing my car all done yeah look looks very very clean but compared to before uh, actually, here I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna give you a uh, ten dollar tip. I feel bad. I don't want to, you know, it's free. Uh, it's a free service, but I I really want to tip you. It was a, it was a very good service. Thank you once again, though. Very very nice. Thank you for your service. Of course, of course. Yeah, it looks very nice though. It looks uh, very spiffy clean. All right, well uh, let's let's get out of here, guys. Um, need to get out of this gas and go. Gas and go usually really gets busy on um. Sunday. I don't know what it is, but it's always busy on Sunday. It, the only other day of the week that can really compare is um Tuesday. I don't know why. No, Monday. I'm sorry. Why did I say Tuesday? Monday. It's always Sunday and Monday. People just must need something from here. Always on Monday. Well, that's cool. They're getting the lawn cut near Gas and Go. That's pretty nice. Alright, guys. I just heard my uh, MDT go off. Looks like we have a call. Two of my old men are fighting. I need some coppers quick. What's going on? Uh, the location was at the farms. So, uh, dispatch, go ahead and show me en route. I'm gonna go code two. Because, uh, if they're fighting, I don't want anything to escalate. So let's, uh, let's go. Just gonna go code two, though. I think I've already got one deputy responding. So that's pretty nice. Alright, guys, we're on the scene. L yeah, it looks like there's one deputy here already. Also, I forgot to point out, I'm using this uh, tw new 2013 Explorer. It's very nice. Oh, my car is dirty again. Of course, I got the car washed for no reason. There's a fight? Okay, hold on. Dispatch, go ahead and show me on scene. We're going to be at the uh, farms. No additional 1032s needed. Okay. I swear, it's like this every day. Stop trying to get me to pay you. You don't pay me enough. Uh, hey. Guys, why don't we take a chill, Okay. Chill out. What, what, somebody tell me what's going on here. Whoa, they crashed into each other, huh? Okay, wait. He was the one who called the police. A uh, deputy. 
Try your best to talk. Try your best to talk to him, the one who called the police. Get 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 an insight on what's going on. This doesn't concern you. Uh, yes, it does, sir. I assume it. I assume. I assume your son called the police. That's why we're here. Okay. I assume he called the police. That's that's why we're here. That child. He doesn't pay me enough. Then he crashed into me. Okay. What does what does he doesn't pay me enough have to do with this? I don't get it. What, what does payment have to do with this? You're not the one paying for the car, are you? I don't think so. Yeah, you're not the one paying for the car. Or the tractor. I don't know which one you were driving. He only pays me $100. Um, I don't know if you know that, but $100 an hour is uh, really, really a lot. You mean $10 an hour? It was literally bringing crops. Then you hit me with the tractor. Okay. So he was the tractor driver. Okay, wait. Don't get back away from each other. No, nope, back away. Back away. So what, what are you guys? Like, um, brothers, co-workers, friends? Okay, you guys are friends. I will pull my bat on you. Okay, guys. Well, it seems like... The police really, we aren't needed really here unless uh, one of you wants to press charges. You guys want to press charges? Because honestly, like, this just is like a really childish fight that you guys need to, like, resolve ASAP. Alright, if we have to come, if we have to come back here and you guys are, if you guys have weapons drawn, somebody's going to get in trouble, okay? It doesn't matter what weapon it is, something that can cause damage. Now, you guys have to figure out a way to pay for your tractor and uh, truck damage. Because, um, I don't know. I don't know how you're going to get that. Alright, you, you guys sound good? Back up. Do n no fighting, okay? I, I hope... Who owns the property? Actually, who owns the property? Okay. Well, sir, either get him off your property or stop fighting. Th this is really childish. You guys are workers. It's it's way too early in the morning for this. Way too early. He asked me to work for him. I mean, you're working for him. So, either quit your job or grow up. I'll get you out of here and beat you up. Alright, solve this now. Before I, before I leave, back up. So You guys have to solve this now. He said, F fine. Yeah, please... Like, please, okay? Please. So, Roy caused the crash? Okay. Now, uh, go- Why don't you go back to your duties? Go in the barn, do something. I'm just gonna get this sorted. Alright. So, uh, so what seems to- What seems to have happened, deputy? What I'm thinking here is this is just an old- This is just a- Like a regular fight. We- We aren't really needed here. I get- I get- Yeah, you were scared. I get you were scared, but- you know, sometimes adults argue like that. There's nothing really much we can do. Seems like Jake called caused the crash. Okay. I'm a little deaf. Can't hear what you're saying. Okay. Sorry about that then. Alright, well. Yeah, okay. So, I'm gonna say it again. I know that you were scared. But, um. I know that you were scared. But there's nothing we can do. You know, your, your old men are just fighting. I mean, uh, yeah, unless you want us to arrest it. We can't really arrest them. I mean, it's their property, you know. Unless somebody pulls out a weapon, there's nothing we can really do. I'm sorry, man. If I were you, I would just leave the property yourself. They can't They can't force you to be here. I mean, I, I, they're allowed to have a weapon, you know. If they have a license for it, they're allowed to. So. Alright, Deputy. Scratch the notes. Let's go. This is... It's a waste of our time. Come on. Definitely a waste of time. Alright. Sorry for the inconvenience, guys. If we do have to come back here, one of you will probably be arrested. Do not pull any weapons. Don't do anything. Just please have a, have a great day. It's a, it's a great Sunday. Have a good day, okay? You too, officer. Thank you. Alright, let's go. Right. Dispatch, go ahead and uh, show me code 4. Situation's gonna be clear. Um, it's just a... Uh, it's just a civil argument. Nothing much. It's not It's not really the fight that it claimed to be. Gonna be going back available. 
All right, whoa, whoa, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna go probably run some radar, maybe. I do have, uh, actually, I, yeah, I do have radar. I just don't have my ALPR th today, unfortunately, you know. Whoa, that guy's car is still smoking. Remember earlier how I pointed out his car was smoking? Okay, yeah, let's, I'm gonna go ahead and get him. Let's go ahead and get him. I, I you know, I, I was gonna tell him, but then he left. And I, I didn't, I didn't want to give my efforts to pull him over. All right, let's get him. He said, hashtag. All right. Let's see. Okay. Um, dispatch, go ahead and show me on a 1011. It's going to be a white Prius. We're going to be on Highway 55 going south near the Freedom Ave intersection. No 1032s required at this time. All right, just gotta switch sides because I really couldn't see you. But hello, sir. How you doing today? Hope you're doing well. It's a really Sunday morning, so um, do you know why I stopped you today? Well, I'm doing great. Thank you. Uh, okay, so you know, so you're aware of why I stopped you, right? So you're aware that your car is smoking, sir, right? I really hope you're aware. Okay, uh, is there any reason for this? Is there any reason? I was going to fix it. You're going to fix it right now. So, like, as we speak. This is my car. No, okay. Well, uh, since I do, I do have to say, like, your car is, like, not road safe. So, uh, if you don't mind, I, I would need your license and registration. No need for your insurance right now. Yep, go ahead and hand that over for me. Thank you. All right, I'll be right back. Oh, go ahead and go ahead and sit tight for me. All right. All right. So he he knows his car is damaged. Apparently he's going to fix it. So oops, wrong thing. Let's search that. Okay, it's all active. All right, everything's valid. I'm just okay. Uh, dispatch. Go ahead and uh, requesting 132. I'd like this. Uh, hold on. I'm actually instead of doing that, I'm gonna beep at this tile. Make him come over here. Signal him. Yeah. Make a little le illegal U-turn. All right. Oh, no need to get so close to me. Howdy, deputy. Uh, sorry to call you over here, but um, I, I would just have a favor if you if you don't mind doing it for me. Also, guys, take a moment to acknowledge my cool-looking uniform. I got the YouTube logo, and I got my name on it. But, uh, yeah, I would like you to escort this guy to the mod shop in the city. Whoa, what's going on? Anyways, yeah, I would like you to, um, escort him to the mod shop. I'm just gonna go ahead and talk to him if you don't mind coming over here. Whoa, did not see that guy. Alright, sir. So, uh, your vehicle is not road safe. Uh, here's your information back. Oh, so your vehicle isn't road safe and you're going to fix it. So I'm going to have my deputy here, uh, transport you to the mod shop. Because I, I don't want you to, I don't want to dismiss you with a smoking car. So, uh, you're free to go. Just the deputy, yeah, the deputy is going to pull in front of you. And just follow him to the mod shop, okay? Have a nice, have a nice, uh, day. Morning, whatever. You as well. Thank you. Okay. Dispatch, go ahead and uh, show me code for the situation is under control. We've got a deputy currently transporting the uh, man with a stolen car. Um, I said stolen car. Are you seriously? Smoking car. All right, guys. Well, that call is settled. I'm probably just going to find a spot up near the county area to uh, go ahead and uh, run radar. I think that's the only logical thing to do right now. Because I, I mean, I'm kind of... Oh. Oh, this is perfect. This is perfect. Uh, well, I'm just going to make a little bit of an illegal thing. Looks luckily no one is behind me. I'm just going to sit here, honestly. I don't care if my car is hidden or not. I'm gonna, I mean, I have the radar. And I can just check whatever one's going. That guy's going 40. That guy's going 50. I just track everything. Well, guys, I'm actually, I'm getting a call from, uh, my sheriff. Okay, that's weird. Uh, hello? Sheriff? 
It's pretty odd that you're calling me through my uh, phone, but I, I don't mind. What's going on? Yeah, you got something? Currently just running radar if uh, you were wondering. Just running radar on the side of the highway here. Well, that's pretty weird. He's calling me. Can I get you back to the sheriff's office? Uh, am I in trouble? Hopefully not. I, I think I'm in trouble, guys. Oh, wait. No, I'm not in trouble? Okay. That's great. Great, great, great. Alright, well, uh, Sheriff, I'll see you there. Thank you. Let's make a quick little U-turn. Guys, I'm sorry if I do some unrealistic stuff. That's, uh... I don't... I don't mean to, but sometimes you got to, you know? Alright, I'm gonna head down to the sheriff's office right now. Oop. Hopefully, you know, whatever he has for me is great. Whoa, that red car is driving a little bit too, um, sticky. Alright, here we are. Oh, we also got some other sheriffs. Oh, wait, he's the sheriff's right there. Alright. Dispatch, go ahead and, uh, show me a 10-5. Instead of being at a uh, gas station or a food place, I'm going to be at the sheriff's office talking to the sheriff. You know, I figured I'd put that in. Hello, sheriff. How's it going? Over here. What's going on? All right. So, we're in it, guys. We're in his office now. Hopefully, you know, it's nothing too bad. I have something to tell you. Uh, okay. What is, what's, what is it? What's going on? Now I'm kind of scared, you know. <laughs> the sheriff calling you in is not... I mean, I am a sergeant. I, I do have connections with the sheriff, but it's not always... Um, not always good. Sometimes it's bad. You know, I really don't do stuff with them out of, out of work. But, you know, sometimes... Come to episode 5 to see what's going on. Yeah, guys, you heard it first. Come to episode 5 um, next Sunday to find out what the sheriff has to tell me. Let me know you guys' thoughts on what the sheriff is going to tell me in the comments below. Thank you for watching episode 4. Hope you guys all enjoyed. Let me know what you did think of the video. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow is not going to be a roleplay. It's going to be a showcase. But uh, either way, I, th I think you guys will still like it. Thank you all for joining. Make sure you join all my discords. Links are down below. Without further ado, see you guys tomorrow.